we like to be to a degree that's that's why we have the whole mud runner uh, the hardcore plus idea that prang kept on breaking a few episodes back um <laughs> well i don't so. think i did well the the rule that we had since i think it was about season i don't know was that we would only ever walk if it was physically impossible for us to get there any other way and in many of the cases you could have absolutely just reversed a couple of meters So let's load up with some logs. Oh no! Let me forward a bit. I hate getting your crane stuck on one of the uh, sort of ribs of the the truck. Oops! It's just the worst feeling. Because you think something's gone wrong. Okay. Oops. That way around. How you doing, Prang? I don't know. Okay. Well, I don't either. I was hoping you might know a bit more than me. Go up in the air. Are you bush bashing? Yeah. As we call it down under. I can see a clearing, but it's probably oh, a road I've just come off. Hang no. on, I'll look at the map for you. I'm getting close. But oh yeah, you are. You're about half, you're more than halfway there. Yeah, I know. Bon Jovi would be proud. You're almost there. Yeah, I know. Whoa, almost. you're halfway there. Whoa. I was trying to think of a log-related thing that rhymed with air. Um, I might not be able to get up. I've uh, exited. Ah. Connecting. I should get back. Hopefully you pop back in. You've disappeared off the side of my screen, so you might have to rejoin. That probably just tells us that our internet's gone funny. Although usually it doesn't fully disconnect you. I'll keep driving. But... Okay. Um, be back? Nope. Oh, okay. Uh, so shall I cancel this? Mm, no. If it's connecting to Steam, oh. you might want to jog, oh, it, jog out and uh, check what the router's doing, because I've not got anything. Um. No, I mean, walk into the other room. You've not got anything either. I, I've not had any problem. It's not told me anything, but I'm hosting the server. It should still have told me that there's a problem. No, it doesn't say I've got a problem. I'll just try loading YouTube. Internet works fine for me. Uh, Prang just asked if it was the internet. I don't think so, given that it works fine for me. Prang's just called in from the other room to tell us that the uh, router's colors, you know, the, the, whoops, the uh, lights on it are all good. So, um, when he gets back, I don't know where he's disappeared off to, but when he gets back, I'll uh, try and get him to use the uh, troubleshooting thing. But I really dislike that he's just walked out, because it makes it more difficult. Hang on, I'm just going to press the troubleshoot button on his computer. Okay, just the Windows troubleshooter, which half the time just resets the uh, thing and fixes it. Whee. Sorry, I'm keep on turning around to Frank's computer and not looking where I'm going, which is a recipe for disaster, as I'm sure you uh, <laughs> you know from experience of watching us. Um, although if you don't, welcome to our videos. We are honoured to have you here. Ooh, that didn't feel very good. Okay, I fixed his thing. Get him back in now. And I think he should be able. Oh. 
He's right here. <laughs> Sorry, I was halfway between our microphones shouting at what I was doing on your screen. Um, you just should just be able to rejoin the game and it should work fine. Just your um, the, the um, network adapter in your computer just needed a reset. I don't know. Just stop working. Might actually be worth stopping your OBS recording and starting again just to make sure everything's all right. It probably will be fine, but... And just let me know when you're starting. Starting on my mark, mark. You can just say the word starting. <laughs> oh no. That's more fun saying that. Yeah, well. Boat cater. Okay, back in the boat cater, we're gonna fix this catastrophe up. Maybe. Um. Hmm. You, um, just make sure you jump in and out when you get back in game. Oh, I see. Half the problem is that I've got the pipe break on. Oh, oh, your boat case is there. Oh, do you in my? Yeah, it says you're in on my screen. It's not going anywhere. Encoding overloaded. Oh, okay. Just restart it. Stop. Okay. Let's try reverse. Start. Now. Come on, you rotten so and so. Encoding overloaded. Ugh. There we go, I'm finally reversing. Okay, going in again and start. It's unusual for us to have to do it this many times. I mean, half the time it'll be fine with the encoding overload, but I just feel like it's not worth the risk. There we go. No, that's okay. I'll move the camera as well. Cool. All right. Prang is back. And I'm not going anywhere. Well, I'm not really going very, very far. <sighs> that is doing nothing for me. I wonder if I switch that to pull. Because there is a fence there. On. I've just got these reeds hovering over my boat. There we go. Thank you. Oh, I'm stuck again. Oh, there we go. It's got these reeds. But they're coming up again. Yeah, this is that wheel, those two wheels that I was talking about. You can see them. Wheels. Just stop. Two well, I was wheels. saying there was two big invisible wheels in the middle of the boat cater. Two invisible wheels. I don't yep. understand. The, the way that they've probably made the thing is by using a truck that's got two giant invisible wheels. Oh, okay. And that's right. how it right. actually right. physically yeah. drives. Right, okay. Is that moving? If it is, it's moving so slowly. Go back and try again. Go a bit further up so I've got better mechanical advantage. Although I've just stopped. Why have I just stopped there? It's really frustrating. Surely Forward that's not left. it. What? Giant toadstools. Oh wow! Is it? That's really cool. Yeah, I'd say it is. Okay. You sure? Yeah, you're in the you're in that spot. It's got to be. They're not in the base game, so they'll have added them in. That's pretty cool. Okay. Ooh. Sorry, guys. It's, it is cool, but it, it just took me an awful long time to get to. 
you, you, you'd really built him up for something. Yeah, yeah, I just thought it was, it was just be, so totally uh, different to what he was expecting. Um, a free, you know, five hundred dollar voucher for um, some uh, video equipment, uh, some uh, computer equipment. <laughs> Never mind. Maybe <laughs> thought, next time. Thought it was going to be a brand new CPU. Yeah, which I think I'm going to need soon. Yeah, I, I think definitely by the time, I think definitely by summer. Um, yeah. For several reasons. If you're just playing SnowRunner by itself and we weren't recording, I'd say, oh, screw it, it's fine, don't, don't worry. But because we're recording, a, a, like, a more is at stake. And one thing I do know is that with Steam as the game launcher, um, it Steam is not the best optimized thing in the world, but it's not... Um, like, it doesn't take up much CPU. I can tab out and look at how much it's taking out right now. Um, 0.2% CPU at the moment with 115 megabytes of RAM. Um, but um, I have heard people talking about the Epic Games launcher, which is what SnowRunner will be on, um, taking up like 30% CPU kind of thing. Like, and for random reasons. So clearly it's not well optimized or it's screwing around and doing stuff. Um, so if that's happening, like A, SnowRunner is going to be a more intensive game to run on both the CPU and the GPU. I wish I had some glitter. Why? Well, it's night time now. I'm absolutely... Absolutely what? Well, I can't find my way out, can I? Oh, you, you wish you'd left a trail of breadcrumbs. A trail of breadcrumbs or... Yeah, fair enough. Fair enough. Here we go. Yeah, no, I know what you mean. Um, but yeah, so because like it's going to be taking more to do that, to do just run mud runner by uh, snow runner by itself, and we're going to have to be uh, there's the potential that it's going to. But he's gonna... gone and done it as quickly as that. Wow, well done. Um, it's also going to have to cope with whatever is happening with the Epic Games launcher. Um, sorry, I'm just concentrating on my reversing it. Um, yeah, you, like once those are there, um, then if the, a, a bit of an issue happens with the encoding, which mostly is the GPU, but it is a bit CPU in, uh, um, it, it, you know. It's not having to process much because we're doing it in quite high uh, high quality, so it's just dumping heaps of stuff. But yeah, it just means there's more at stake. So if um, yeah, it's yeah, I'm I'm going to shut up now because he's going to shut up. Now. Yeah, uh, I was exp I started off explaining it quite well, and my brain has just turned into jelly from doing this bridge. Um, but oh well, I think you can probably work out what I'm trying to say. No. Oh, okay. I'll yeah, I can. I, I, I can. I know what you're trying to say. Cool. <sighs> it's probably the last time I'll go across this bridge. Here we go. I've had to rebuild it about three or four times now. Close it up, close it up, close it up, close it up. We'll probably read the um, description again and it'll say, you know, this is a single player only map. It will have lots of errors if you um, do it in multiplayer and we'll go, oh. Well, in fairness, Dimitri did uh, give, tip us the nod about this. Oh, that's map. right. He did recommend it, didn't he? When we finished Unreachable City. Yeah. It's all your fault to me. No, I'm no, kidding. No, no. I'm so kidding. I I'm think kidding. He would have said, "I'll do it single player." Yeah. No, I'm only kidding. It could even be to do with how we've got, you know, Mudrunner Plus and stuff. Could be sure, an oh, influencing yeah, sure, factor. Because yeah, yeah, yeah. there is a glitch happening one way or another, and it's quite possible that it's our fault rather than the mod's fault. I'm perfectly happy for that to be the case. 
Come on. Oh, okay. Hey. Looks pretty good. Okay, almost finished building this bridge again. A bit to the left, a bit to the right, a bit to the left, a bit to the right, a bit to the left, a bit to the right, a bit to the left, a bit to the right, a bit to the bit to the bit to full stop. Cool. Now you gotta go all the way back over to your truck, which is on the far side. And then you gotta get back to it and then turn around. So, are you... Well, at the fuel station. Okay. And you're going to now come and use this bridge to bring your um, logs across and build the sauna, right? Yep. Cool. Come on! There we go. Okay. We've got two tankers. Two tankers? Yep. That makes sure that the toots don't fly away. Ah, yes, uh, anchoring your toots. Make yep. sure your toots are extremely well anchored. Yep. Yep. And do you know what? Like, it's all good making sure that your sun... Um, your sun toots are anchored. But the most important thing is <laughs> Moon toots? is to make sure your toot toot anchor, toot anchor moon, your toot anchor moon, toot anchor moon. <laughs> like I said many times before, if you ignore him, you will probably shut up. <laughs> oh come on! At least give it to me that I was making. I was doing a fairly good job of uh, stretching that one out. <laughs> okay, we're going to want to come to stop here. And um, not stop engine, we're going to want to change the truck. We're going to pull out of here after we take our hand brakey off. Is park brake the American sort of term for handbrake, or...? No, the handbrake is the thing between the seats. What's the park brake? Well, the park brake is on an automatic car. It's the P. P-D-I... Oh! P-D-I... L1, L2, or so D1, D2. So what we always call a park brake is not... It was what we often call a handbrake is not actually a handbrake. What do we call it? Well, you know how we press space bar? Oh, in this? Yeah. In Unreal Life? Yeah. Yeah. Sorry, um, in, in real life? Yes. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. Come on, you little truck. It's, um... Okay. Yeah, the park, it just locks it in completely on the, the, um... The, um... The handbrake? It, 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 it makes pigs t come to a complete stop. It's the handbrake. Hand. You apply it with your hand instead of your f the foot brake. The hand brake... It's just a wire contraption that locks in the usually the rear wheels of the car. Oh, is it just the rear? Um, I think so, yeah. So it's actually... Because that's yeah, how okay. you can do a handbrake turn. Ah, of course. It just locks the back wheels, so you just... Um, whereas a park brake... You actually, can't do a park brake turn, can you? No, it, it, well, it actually locks the whole transmission of an automatic. Like, you ain't going to get a park brake in a manual vehicle. 
So the confusion here is the fact that we've got manual because we're using the, the, sh the shifter. We've got external USB controllers, Logitech controllers. 